Hi, I'm Peter Haddock from Earth Movers magazine, and today I'm with Rupert Craven at Ritchie Brothers. It's pouring it down with rain here in their new Maltby quarry. But Rupert's actually been talking to Earth Movers recently about trends in the industry, and we've also been looking at, at how things are going um, as far as the sale of equipment's concerned. We started off for our first auction here in February, and we had Brexit in March. Yeah. We're now having the last auction here in. Uh, in November and we've got an election in December and Brexit after that depending on what happens so for everybody everybody in the industry and not just in, in this industry but uh, across the UK there's been uncertainty but you still want to carry on so we've got an auction here tomorrow we've got 1500 lots we'll be selling for nine hours tomorrow we yep. sell a whole range of machinery both young and old through from there overall and underlying I think there's some good healthy things for the UK there's plenty of infrastructure products planned there's lots to happen people have got good fleet they're ready to go from there but I think it's really just getting over these next couple of months finding out what happens after that and I think we could see a real real boost on the reverse of that though is the better the UK economy goes and the more people are confident about it the stronger the pound gets yeah absolutely. And that really does cause a problem for us exporting 70% of the machinery that we'll sell here uh, tomorrow and Wednesday will be sold out of the UK Right, so that's really important because I think what, what you've got to recognise is it's a great environment for people to, to actually get their cash out of their equipment because you know you mentioned different projects coming along but some of those elements have stalled like HS2 has stalled for example. I mean it is going now going back on after the election as such but we've got other things like Highways England projects coming up so it's actually a time where people have got to think about their fleet mix because we're seeing with Highways England of course raising the bar that... Uh, they're mandating machine control. We've got younger equipment here, 2016, that can take that retrofitting of machine control systems. You've got people that are, are selling out older units so they can reinvest in some of the latest technology on site as well. And so how, how are we seeing the conversation from that? Well, we always aim to have a big range of machinery, both from the newer stuff to the older stuff, every for different pockets from different places through from there. But most of the newer machinery, as you say, can be retrofitted. So it doesn't have to be direct from the manufacturer as intelligent, but it can be always fitted on afterwards for the right machinery. Yeah, so how do people get involved? Main thing is go to the website, www.rbauction.co.uk, get on and register, have a look at the inventory there. You can do everything from the comforts at home pretty miserable here on site Certainly so uh, you can do your checks beforehand but we put a lot of effort into our detailed equipment information so you can see exactly what the machines are like from here and you can bid online through from that we'll probably be seeing well over 50 percent of our of our bidders will be online yeah. through from that so it's going more and more that way and what's quite interesting about today is the fact that i've seen quite a few people coming around looking around at machinery actually testing it as well so they can actually gauge uh, a little bit more of their intelligence about the machine so that they can place their bids on the auction day and think actually I'd rather go for this one than that one for example so that's what today's all about is it is well after the people. last few days yeah. it's still an auction you know the buyers got to make their own due diligence and their own prep and things yeah. like that but we've got everything here for, to facilitate that so they can have a look around and check on the machine they want and hopefully bid very strongly for that one machine. Well, there's a lot of people that are going to be here tomorrow. There's also a lot of people that are going to be bidding online and on your new app as well. Have a good auction.